Hello and welcome back friends. Today here you can see red globe grapes and from these grapes we're gonna grow some grape plants. These grapes are very famous in the world. They were originated in California and because of their big size and very much juicy they are now famous in the whole world. Every of the supermarket in the world has these grapes these days. So you can find these grapes in one of the supermarket at your store. So today we're going to learn how to get plants out of these seeds. Every of the grape has four seeds in it. So collect as many seeds as possible to get the best result. I have collected few over here. I'm taking peat moss and perlite for growing medium. You can find best seeds growing medium in the local grocery store for the best result or you can use with the garden soil mixed with compost also. So here distribute the seeds evenly over the peat moss and perlite composition and cover them with the soil. And water them thoroughly and place these guys in the indirect sunlight where it is nice and warm for the best growth. Taking after two weeks it's nice weather and sometimes it is rainy over here you can see two saplings has grown in the beginning I'm not sure whether they are exactly the grape plants or not because similar kinds of weed I have seen outside so I didn't know whether they were grape plants or not so I just left it like that to check whether they will be the real grape plant or not checking after 30 days since those plants were doing so well, I placed them in the sunny side and they even grew better. And I saw that the grape leaf has appeared on them. So it confirmed that it is a grape plant and I was so happy about that. And these plants are really doing good so far. They were kept moist all the time and a lot of water is given to them for the best growth. Out of those seeds only two plants has grown and I'm hoping that other will also grow in future. Now we're gonna transplant those guys into bigger pots so that they can grow well. Here taking the bigger cups bottle like that and placing the peat moss perlite as earlier and you can see here the roots are intact at the base with this plant and another plant also you can see a few roots down there so gently separating them and removing most of the soil out of it so that it will be easier to put them inside these bottles I'm using the same soil which I used while growing the seeds and those still have some seeds in it hopefully they will also grow and just transplanting these young plants into these bottles for the best growth and water them thoroughly you can see it has little bit more of perlite but there is no problem just keep them like this after three months of time they have grown really well they are really tall you can see number of leaves out there the roots has grown so long and the plant is healthy so far you can see one of the plant it seems dead I don't know exactly why it is like that but I am going to leave like that and one plant also grew in there which I plucked it up because it seems like it was completely dead I just took it out the root were really healthy the seed was intact and I was confused whether the plant was really dead or not so I checked the stem, I broke it up and look it inside and it was still green. So the plant was not dead. That happened so you should be careful. Checking after 4 months, the completely dead looking plant on the left side, it has completely grown a new stem on the right side and the plant is really healthy. All of the plants are really doing good so far. So basically these grape plants, the stem look very much dead in the in the winter time or sometime it looks like that and you should not be confused that it is dead 
so just leave it like that and once the warm temperature comes up they will again grow so here you can see those dead looking plant is still growing healthy checking after four months you can see that even it has grown more taller and more healthier so this is how i have achieved some great plants out of the seeds so if you have any queries please comment below i'll be more than happy to answer you and if you like my video please do share it give it a thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe for more interesting videos thank you and see you again